Hey, 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 guys, this is Hawkeye back with the Catch Carp and Course, and we are back here at Loch Mickle. I have been doing a little bit of research on some of the best places to fish on this particular lake. Now, I've managed to catch quite a few species, I've managed to catch some specimen fish, but still looking for that boss fish, and some of my research has brought me to this location down here. Apparently, this is a really good spot for fishing for boss fish and there's apparently one right up here as well that you can get to by boat. Now I think I'm going to go ahead and start off shore first of all. See if we can't locate some of these carp boss fish that are out there. Now the location that I saw from my research of YouTube and some other places is right here I was noticing that there's that rock out there hoping you know, right in this direction I'm hoping that we can pull off finding them as well but we have got all the wrong gear here we're gonna have to change back to our our mix now maybe our mix let me ch yeah I think I'll go ahead and check the mix first let's see Nah, uh, nah, I think we'll just do our carp tackle box for now. Got a lot of stuff on here that we can use. We got chicken livers. I'm gonna take those off probably. So we're not after catfish at this point. Well, we'll now we'll throw it out there and see what we can do here. Now, actually, we need to find a, a peg location. I thought this would be one. We can cast. Oh, okay, here it is. Let's get ready to say. This should be the right spot. Perfect. Try this right over here. I'm already seeing some movement. if these guys are actually out here. Like I said, there is plenty of movement. Actually, I might go ahead and pull one in a little bit further. There we go. Oh, there we go. Number two. Yeah, apparently this is also a great spot. Ooh, koi! It's a koi. It's apparently also an awesome spot for northern pike too. So I might <coughs> so I might actually try a little bit of spin casting here in a minute. That's a good size koi. Got some interesting coloration on it. blue on him or something. Let me get a good look at that. Oh wow, that's a pretty fish. He's just common, but very, very pretty. Apparently 
because this is a majorly active location. Yeah, I think I will switch one out with something else. Let's see here. Need to come up with something that I know they can't resist. Let's try a see what that does. Holy crap, that was quick. Yeah, this is a good spot. <laughs> sure what this is but I don't think it's that big can't really tell what that is it might be some kind of a trout but I can't get a good look at it maybe a Lennox trout or a rainbow trout Arctic Char. I was completely wrong. Was not expecting him. Yeah, you're not going to get 100% on this. The settings on here are so sensitive. lost that one. Not sure why. My hook keeps slipping. And we were getting a bite off of one of those others. I may have to check the bait. <coughs> and he's still on it. Oh, now I got three of them going here. This is not an arctic char. Maybe a rainbow trout or a brown trout, I can't really tell. Oh, he's pretty good size too. Boy, this is a really good spot, guys. That heartbeat thing they throw in there really makes it... <laughs> it really increases the tension a lot. Oh, you little... You little dickens, you were trying hard to give me the slip. There we go, we got him. That's a nice rainbow. He's a specimen. 16 pounds. Not complaining about that. Now let's just see if we can get this one before he gets away. Yeah, guys, that new game, Bass Master. Fishing. There's a lot of techniques I've learned from here and Fishing Sim World Pro Tour. They have it's like they've incorporated different aspects of the mechanics from both of those games into that one. So playing these have really prepared me for the other. I still enjoy these games. These are what led to the others, so
got us a new koi here. He's got bright orange on him. He's gonna... Come in here and give me a hard time. Good God, he almost went on shore. That's another one with that blue in him. Yeah, they're only been common ones, but very pretty fish. I will say that. They're very pretty fish. That is gonna work. There we go. Some of these fish have been right close too. I might try casting over here. Let's see if we get anything different over here. There we go. It's a good strike. I don't know why. It's way down with the orange. Okay, let's see. And number two is going off again. Yeah, we've got us another some kind of trout. It's a big one. It might be a rainbow, but it's hard to tell. It's not that orange. Could be an Arctic char also. Ah, we got him. Oh, wow. That is an interesting looking fish. He is a rainbow trout, though. He's got really a lot of spots. Look at him. Specimen fish at 17 pounds, 7 ounces. It's a nice looking fish. Very different. Okay, this guy's been swimming around here <laughs> quite a while now. Another multicolored koi, looks like. He's a fighter, I'll give him that. Got a lot of orange in him. We're getting close to leveling up one more time, that's great. Darn near every lure I have attempted, I have gotten something pretty good off of it. You gotta be kidding. Finally, the third one.
Man, I gotta see what I got on this one, but I think it's another trout. It's not real big. I think I might have one on each, on the other two as well. Yeah, if he's a little Linux. Or Ferrix. Why do I want to say Linux? I don't know why. Holy crap, that was a big fish. Okay, let's see what finally went for that. Koi? He's a big fat coin. Come on. Well, he does not want to come in. There we got him. Wow, that's a nice one. He's good size. Yeah, he is a specimen too. I figured as much. For some reason, I can't get the pictures to take. Hmm. There it goes. Well, we have gotten quite a few of them. I think I'm going to cast this way out there. Ah, we got one on one of the other ones. Back to three. That's kind of some odd coloration. What I really like about these guys is they're all different. Sounds like I got one on the second one too. He's actually pretty good size. Wow, that's some odd coloration. Another specimen. This pop up tiger nut's really been very productive. This one doesn't seem to be that big.
what we got here. You can see they're a mirror or leather carp. We got him. Yep, a mirror. We are almost ready to level here, guys. The next fish will probably do it. Let's try throwing this over this side this time. Don't know if I can get it all the way over there. Oh, there we go. Oh, crap. What the hell was that? Let's try that again. God bless it. Gotta take the tension down this time. <laughs> Whatever that was, he snapped it within a second. Got us another trout here. Another ring? No, it's an arctic char. That's not a rainbow. This guy's been persistent. Is he red? Or just a really dark orange.
Okay, this guy is... There we go, we got him. Yeah, he's really orange. He's a red orange. Yeah, that really, really aggravates me that I lost that fish. He was big, whatever he was. He went right for that spinnerbait. got us a rainbow. He wasn't that big fella. That might have been a boss fish. As hard as he hit. Yep, definitely a rainbow. We've got something this time. I don't think it's a trout. I am so hoping it's that big old fish. If not, we definitely gave it our best. He has been eluding us. He's been just out of reach. I don't know what kind of pike that was. One, I think it was the same one that broke the line. Now we're going to have to fight him like nobody's business to get him in. Either way, we have played quite long enough. So we're definitely coming back here again, there's no doubt. I'm going to try this on the boat too. Especially that other spot I've been told about. This fish isn't even budging. No, I knew he wasn't a trout. I knew he wasn't a trout. The lines behind him in the water were too long. That's the one we've been after. Holy crap, this is quite the fish. Let's 
a little more tension because he's starting to swim towards us now. Gotta watch it though, he did snap it before. This is a clever fish. Was it clever gal? Closest I've had him yet, guys. We got him. We got him. Finally. Holy crap. Holy crap. That's a specimen. It's not a boss, but it's the biggest one I have caught. Without a doubt. 40 pounds, 12 ounces. Decent fish, guys. Very decent fish. Nice. You get a picture of him. Oh, yeah. Not a boss. Darn it. Not a boss. I can't even imagine that. Bosses must be something. Well, anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed that episode. We've definitely proven this to be the hot spot that everybody has told me that it is. Anyway, guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye bye.